Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy. Hey guys, today we're going to be comparing side-by-side -side the Android Wear app versus the Gear Manager app. So today we're really going to compare just the apps themselves, not the watches, but the apps themselves that really make the watch connected to your device. So on Android Wear, uh, since it is the newer of the two, it's very, very simplistic in its design. Uh, you can connect to your watch right up here at the top. You have a settings portion, which goes a little bit more in depth. And right here, you actually can set what apps launch where. So if, you're, if you set a timer, is it going to be the clock or is it going to be another app? If you set your heart rate, is it going to be the Fit, uh, the Google Fit app, or is it going to be the Heart Rate app? So this is how the basic layout is. I don't have the Lyft one, which would be for the call a car, but this is it. And then it just says Browse Compatible Apps. However, it doesn't have all the compatible apps listed on here, which makes me think that this is more of like a featured list, and that's about it. For, to get real in-depth apps on here, you're going to want to view my other video on the Wear Store. However, up here at the top, we have our settings section, and this is where you can change a little bit of the watch itself. So, you can change to mute notifications or specific ones, screen always being on, hiding cards uh, if you want to always show or always hide, silence, connected phone, show calendar events, uh, debug over Bluetooth, which is really interesting to do debugging over Bluetooth. I haven't needed to do that yet, but you have the ability to. And that is it. That is the Gear La uh, That is the Android Wear app. However, on the Gear Manager, you have a little bit more that you can see on the app itself. A little bit more usefulness, I would say, on the app. Um, you do have the ability, of course, to connect to uh, your device. You have a home screen styler. So from right here, you can actually change the home screen, which I relatively like, uh, just because it's a bigger canvas in order to change things on the home screen. You can even change your colors or your personal images. And from here, you can choose the clock itself, whereas on the Android where you really either go into the third-party app or you go into uh, the watch itself. You can't change the watch from the uh, Android Wear app. Over here again, uh, you have their own fitness section. So this will just take you right into uh, the gear fitness category. You have your notifications, which you can see all the apps that uh, use your notifications and uh, tweak them a bit uh, to use them. So you have that ability right there. As you can see, you can highlight any single app you have on your device. You can also see your own apps and uh, again, change settings on here on the app, which I like. Uh, you can change in order to how the apps operate. It's just a little bit more in depth besides just kind of uh, which, which one launches what. You have your store right here, which this is the full store, so it's a lot more in depth uh, than how the gear wear one has, which is more of a featured category. So you really have all of them right here, and then you can see all of the different apps uh, you can get for your device. And um, there's, a, there's a good amount now. There really has been a lot of them. Um, this is definitely around probably the 400 mark now for the Samsung apps, uh, although the Cure, uh, Gear uh, w Alive for, with Android Wear has already caught up to being about 200. Find my gear, you have on here another nice feature that I like, the ability that I can find my uh, watch if I don't know where it is. And the settings where you can change a bit more, what a double press does on your on your key, on uh, wake gesture, what it does when you wake up the device. Of course, you have incoming calls and uh, different text replies, which I also like, the fact that I can do that right then and there. And that is the Gear Manager app. Which app do you think has a better interface just for the app purposes? The Android Wear app or the Gear Manager app? Please let me know in the comment section down below. And have you ever thought about getting one of these watches? Let me know that as well. Thank you for watching. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy.